Hey, what's up, YouTube? Metal Cabana here, and today I'm showing you guys a preview of OSX Lion, the developer's preview, okay? And, um, this is basically what my dock looks like. Not too different. But as you'll notice, there's a new one here. A uh, new icon, and it's called Launchpad. Now, what Launchpad is, is sort of like an iPad type, uh, hold on one second. It's kind of like an iPad looking thing. <laughs> I guess just like an applications type folder where you can just find all of your software in here. You can make folders just like on the iPad. And it is a bit laggy. It's only the developer's preview, so I'm sure they're going to have all that worked out when they when the full software comes out. Um okay. <laughs> That's basically what it feels like. I'm scrolling with my uh, trackpad, so it's pretty cool. All right. Another thing is they have an all-new UI, as you can see here. Now there's a few settings I kind of messed with, but my scrolls are inverted. They inverted all the scrolls, and the UI, the scrolling bar is much different, as you can tell. They really simplified Finder. Oh. One moment, let me just make it how I had it. Um, scrolling. Okay, there we go. Um, there we go. Um, and here's my folders. They really did simplify it. So it's basically just your applications, your home, your desktop, and all of your files. They did an all my files folder. So you can just quickly find all of your soft software pictures, whatever. All right. Another thing that they did. Oh, I did not quite show you all their UI changes yet. You, they made the uh, three um, close button, minimize button, and size changing button <laughs> different, smaller. Uh, as you can see, this is just sort of a knob that you can just drag to change the view. It's pretty cool. Um, also, yeah, the UI is really pretty cool. Another thing is, if you don't have FaceTime already, it comes with the software because I noticed that it's 99 cents in the Mac App Store. Not anymore. It's free. It comes with it. Another change is your mail app. They really did quite a change on this. Here's all your soft. I mean, here's all your emails, and then here's a preview on the side. Pretty cool. It's much easier. I like it much better. Um. And yeah, another one is my dashboard interface. When I uh, do like an expose of all my things, here's my desktop dashboard. And if I have uh, another full screen add on there, now that's that's going up with the control up, and then control down is just like what it used to only be. Um, another addition, add-on, is they did a, a lot of add-ons to full screen applications like um, Safari. Full screen Safari. It's not quite um, worked out yet. It's just, it has a little bit of problems with the... Let me find it. You know what? I'll do it the cool new way. <laughs> oh and um one moment 
Alright, this is the, how Safari looks. They still have yet to fix this. I don't know what the problem was with that. It looks a little bizarre. And the gradient isn't quite flush yet. It's kind of like a... <laughs> to, it's like one grade, then suddenly into another grade, then into another. And here you can make it full screen. Like so. It's still a little laggy because it is only the developer's preview. in a little while. Okay, and finally, and this is what it looks like full screen. Now, when I do what I just did, making my little expose appear, this all goes into this sort of thing, where now this Safari is full screen, and you can pick which screen you want to see. Uh, I'll go back to here. And I'll close that out and escape it. Menu bar is taking a while to come down. Alright, there we go. Uh, okay. And... As you can see, the selection color is a much deeper blue like this and another change that Apple did with Lion is if you're hoping to run PowerPC applications you can kind of count that out because PowerPC applications no longer run on Lion so yeah <laughs> anyway um so that's the preview of what you're going to be getting when line comes out i'm sure there's going to be much more that was just sort of a sneak preview of the little changes all right guys thanks for watching and i'll catch you guys later